Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Matthew. Good to have you here. This is everything about carnivore today. Today has been a pretty cool morning. I've, I've, I've been doing some different exercises. The wife had me doing her workout routine. She found an eight minute video on YouTube and yeah, I mean, it's pretty interesting. Yeah, it was just basically some floor exercises and there was one exercise where it made me lay on the floor and then I was like swimming. So I'm sure everybody's done it before. Everyone but me. <laughs> no, it was pretty, it's pretty cool. I mean, you know, yeah, I, I just have to get a, a thicker mat because it was just like dug into my ribs. I'm like, yeah, that's not too cool. And then we did these side things. And it was like going into my hip bone and I'm like, I don't know. All right, so anyway, want to show you. And what I'm thinking about this morning, <clears throat> well, I'm always thinking about, I'm always thinking about these, all right? Just because they're crunchy, they're salty, they're good. And it's on the carnivore diet. But this morning, you know what? I gotta tell you, I, I've had the cream coffee, right? I haven't had coffee with bu bu butter. What? Butter. Hmm. Hmm. Butter, you say? That's right, butter. Why did I just make that look in the camera? Because I gotta come up with a little <laughs> photo to point for the, uh, yeah, you know, the thumper thingy. So we'll go like this, butter, butter, hmm, butter. I don't know, I don't know. Okay, so hopefully, <laughs> in all that goofiness I just did, I'll be able to get uh, a little something, something to put online. All right, so anyway, I've never tried this. I've done the cream, which is this cream in coffee. Darlene introduced me to that. I don't put very much. Right now, this is just, this has like just a tiny, tiny bit. I've already had a cup of coffee with cream, but I thought, see the butter? All right, we're gonna take a pad of butter out. It's uh, it's kind of thick. I just dropped it in. Oh, I just dropped it in here. You can see it. All right, visuals, Matthew, visuals. There you go. Ooh, it is melting. The first time I heard of butter, Actually, not the first time, but butter coffee I thought was insane. Of course, you have to look you have to look in the past towards my nutritional background, and that was yeah. You know, you're not going to drink anything like this on plant based, but you know when you really get into the cholesterol and you break down the cholesterol myths, and then you see how how cholesterol is actually really healthy for you. Yeah, it's kind of unlearning and relearning now there, isn't it? Oh yeah, big time. All right, so the butter's turned in pretty good. I got to tell you, I, I love, <laughs> I really like butter a lot. I can't say that I love butter just because I haven't been eat, drinking it. I mean, you know, eating it that long, but it's very smooth in it. I don't know, this stuff has salt in it, so it's salty as well. It's just, it's really good. Right, I'm going to take a little sip. I'm just going to see what we're looking at here. Hmm. I will say this too. I've seen where other people put vanilla in it. When I say other people, I mean only my wife. I it's the only person I know that does that. All right. So let me go ahead and put. Some, I gotta tell you the the butter in the coffee. It's probably doing something for my brain. I just put this creamer in there. Let's go ahead and stir that up. I. I had a cup of coffee with thick cream earlier when I first woke up. It gets your whole body going, okay? And if you haven't had it before, you're, oh. Hmm. Hmm. It's like I'm having a Zen moment right now. My brain feels so good, so on vacation. It, it does it with the cream, sort of. But with the butter, it's, it's really doing something different, I feel like. I feel like... I feel like I'm leveling out in this level of my head. It's like it's calmed everything. So weird. So with the butter and the cream, the butter added, it's like everything goes down to here. 
and it's just at peace. And the rest of my head just feels like there's so much tension taken off of it. I don't know. If you hear somebody singing in the background, that's Darlene. I believe she's taking a shower and singing in the shower. Ah! Don't tell her I told you. <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, all right. So, I, I got to tell you. Oh, my gosh. Man. It, it should be. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it is so good. And when I say so good, it, it's like, it, it's putting my brain into a place where I feel like it's kind of making everything okay. Does that make sense? It kind of feels like I'm at home. It kind of feels like my brain's been craving something. It's been kind of like, ee, you know, like that. And then all of a sudden, just, ooh. And when it's like, hmm, I mean, hmm, like, feels really good. What? You know. Hmm. Hmm. Still haven't gotten used to the scent of Pork rinds. Not yet. You know I got my sour cream, right? Yes, sir. Breakfast of a champion. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be making some... Some... Uh, I think I'm going to make some scrambled eggs today with Kai's cheese. Surprise. This is a diet. A healthy diet. Mm. If you're here for the first time, welcome. Mm. If you would, please smash the like button. Really helps on the algorithms. Really appreciate it. And subscribe. Love to have you here. Along my journey. Today is day 34. I'm going to a graduation today. Looking so forward to it. Mmm. In Tennessee, about 60 degrees outside. I do not see the sun. It's supposed to like rain for like 20,000 hours by now, but I haven't seen any rain. It could have sprinkled a little bit last night, but if it did, it dried up. Mm. Mm. On day 34, where am I at? Well, um, I always think of my blood pressure cuff. I'm gonna grab that for you real quick. Hold on. All right, I'm back. So, <clears throat> where was the uh, blood pressure last night? Right here. Those are insane numbers. Day 34. Getting insane numbers like that. Mm. Mm. I was not prepared for what my blood pressure did. Going down, feeling relaxed, guys. It's like a vacation. <laughs> There's no other way of putting it. You sleep deeper, lose weight, feel great. I was saying in other videos, if you're here for the first time, by the way, welcome. It's kind of late in the video, but I'm not really awake yet. I'm just trying to get in a video before I go because I wanted to say hi. <laughs> and I want to tell you, I'm still alive. I didn't know if I would be. At least I didn't know if I would be 30 days ago or 34 days ago. But with the way I felt, I just felt absolutely phenomenal. So yeah, uh, today feeling really, really good. <laughs> I'm drinking Butter coffee with cream. What? And feeling at my top game. Man. 
It looks like a. It looks like a heaven is what it looks like. It looks like I could drink this all day. It looks like I don't need anything. I could probably drink coffee the rest of my life, and that could be my like my only nourishment. <laughs> it could be. Obviously, it can't, right? Hmm. Hmm. I, I could definitely see how this feeling is addictive. I can see how that becomes your best friend. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, if you're new to the carnivore diet, welcome to the carnivore club. If, you, if you're thinking about it, welcome to the think about stage. If, if what happens to you happens, I mean, happens to you, that happened to me, it's a it's a snap and you're like, you know what? I need to take a chance to unlearn, relearn, see where I'm at in, in three weeks. Well, I'm past that three weeks. I'm past the 30 days. Yay. And I'm going for that 90 what? And I'm going to go for my 60 days. You know, I'm going to check in with you to show you, you know, where I'm at physically for the 60 days. But man, this coffee, who it is, it is, it is, it's good guys. It's it's good. It's makes me feel like um yeah, I'm just in bliss. So now I just have to figure some way to take my cream <laughs> and my butter with me when I'm not at home cuz this this is this is nice. And I'm mostly at home anyway, right? But I guess if somebody were out and about, they could get a refrigerator, <laughs> put it in their car, and uh, keep everything nice and cold. I guess you could take ice. You know, you could take those uh, those uh, uh, those things you freeze in the freezer. I don't know what they're called. Ice packs, I guess. That would work too. Yeah. Because, you know, a lot of y'all are out and about, and you're thinking about, how am I going to continue the carnivore diet when I'm out and about? Is it going to be convenient? I'm going to tell you, yeah, it's very doable. It is doable, guys. The results are worth it. Stacking up the muscle as you work out. The protein, man, the protein. And the muscle comes off. Um, not the muscle. The, the fat. On this diet, the fat gets stripped away. The muscle gets built up if you're working out. All right? But diet is 90, over 90% of it. I'd say 95. If you don't have the right diet, you're not going to have enough energy. If you don't have the right diet, your brain can't heal. When your brain heals, your cognitive abilities increase. Uh, there are so many different diseases that this that this diet helps out with. Obviously, you already know I'm not a doctor. Um, this isn't medical advice, but I'm just giving you hard truth. What's going on? I know nothing, but I know a lot. And it's tripping me out the more that I learn. These experiences are awesome. And yeah, I mean, I didn't even know if I liked the coffee with the butter, with the, I mean, I know I liked it with the whipped cream, but with the butter, man, that's, that's really taking it to a whole, whole other level. So the cream and the coffee was like a one out of 10, it's a 10. With the butter and the cream, because of what it's doing to my head, and it's just putting my, my head so, feeling so good. That, and with every drink, I mean, it just seems to. Yeah, I mean, with every, with every drink, I mean, I'm going to say the first drink that I took of this, between a 1 and a 10, it was a 15. Now, <laughs> I'm being probably too specific, right? So now when I take a sip, instead of a 15, it's like a 12. Now a 12 is, oh my gosh, a 12 is like, you never have a 12, right? But that one, who at first a sip, maybe the second one too, that was a 15. It means something was missing in my body. I, I, Guys, all I can say is try it if you want to. If you don't, in my humble opinion, you're missing out. But you know, I mean, why not unlearn, relearn, and be the best version of yourself. All right. So again, appreciate you showing up. Matthew, that's me. I appreciate you. This is my carnivore journey. 
We're thrilled to be able to be here to share with you. Y'all be good. Peace out.